When I'm having people learn to use the orange whip wedge, there's one drill I really like to give them to get the feel of how to let the shaft unload for them at the right time. Most people's problem is they're pulling so hard on the handle that the shaft backloads at impact. Well, here's your drill. I want you to just hold the club up about a foot and a half or two above the ball. You can stand pretty tall. Kind of lean over on your left foot. Now turn back, and then I want you to turn and stop so that the handle is still pointed backwards. I don't want you to flip the handle. I don't want you to pull your arms through. I'm going to turn and I'm going to stop my body. My hands are going to stop sharply. And what you see is the shaft unloads and kicks forward. That delivers all the energy to the club head. Now it's much like if you were fly fishing. If you had a fly rod and you're going to draw back, when you stop your rod handle, the fly rod unloads the, the fly and shoots it forward. So if you were going to do the same thing with your wedge, if you threw the handle, your line would get all caught up in the bushes just like fly fishing and you would be topping and sculling your wedge. So do this drill, learn to turn and stop so that you feel the unload of the orange whip wedge shaft. That'll help you get a sense of when you pick up your real wedge, how to let the club head unload on the ball and make solid contact